In the middle of the night, a stray bullet flew through a home in Queens and hit the family dog. After days in the hospital and even a glimmer of hope, the dog died. Tonight, a teenager, apparently playing with a gun, faces charges. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson has the story from Howard Beach. <laughs> She loved the snow. Aria, a Pomeranian Husky mix, was a spunky six-year-old. Lisa tells me the second she saw her, she had to have her. It had to be her way or no way. She was the boss. <laughs> but now everyone here in Lisa's neighborhood in Howard Beach is rallying around the 36-year-old. Aria died on Friday. I can't be in my parents' room. I can't sleep on myself. I'm just a mess. Take a look. That's a huge bullet hole in the window right next to her parents' bed. Monday morning around 1.30, they were asleep. Lisa's brother heard glass shattering and then Aria whimpering. He saw all the, a lot of blood. And he's like, we have to get her to the vets. Aria would need surgery. A bullet was lodged in her leg. The family was stunned and called police. They spotted this second bullet hole in a neighbor's home where Joshua Marte lives. The 18-year-old's mother told detectives her son had fired the guns, which at first she hid in the freezer. Police recovered them. Aria seemed to be doing better in the hospital, but Friday took a turn for the worst. Lisa last saw her on Thursday. She just looked tired. She saw my sister-in-law. She walked herself out of the cage, and she, like, wanted to come home to us. Lisa did get a restraining order and tells me she wants nothing to do with her neighbor, who she's never met. <laughs> Aww. It's okay, girl. The suspect was charged with criminal possession of weapons and reckless endangerment. It's not clear if that will be upgraded. It's heartbreaking. It's heart she was my little girl. Kimberly Richardson, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.